I don't know why Zeus ain't just hired me to do the reunion. Child, they sitting there trying to be cute and creative. I guess they said, baby, since we always talk about doing our big one, we might as well go ahead and get the biggest boss. Let's talk about it. people to have fun let's kick back let's get into a little tea let's not get too crazy but let's enjoy the sip clock that tea but let's get to the chi chi the kiki the the internet bull <laughs> daddy daddy shot a clock every minute please no natalie you always want to do baddie betty shot a clock did you get that apple out? of course she is because they don't feed y'all that's probably the first and last and only meal that she probably had during that got well it's biggie so <laughs> who am i lying to big dominican you know big biggie don't miss a meal big biggie always gonna find a fool and I'm, I'm i apologize too i don't want nothing to happen to you too that's why you know i get back because i'm like we are the injured reserve and we gotta look out for each other while we're here because can i get a hug yeah okay you're not gonna... right, over the table Can I sneak? <laughs> Girl. Okay. Okay. yeah i'm gonna pull you over the table okay. and hug you some more, bitch. <laughs> They have them with me, so let them say it. She's I'm only right. for one purpose. What I'm trying to understand. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me see, 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 let me see. Let me show y'all. Cause like, why, why does everybody look like this? Look at, look at Evelyn. <laughs> I should start all the way back here. Uh, speaking of ketchup, I got my food here. I need to eat at the same time. I need to do my makeup for the rest of the video today. So. Tokyo looking like that. Why is Tokyo looking like that? And why does that look like the same wig that Michael Jackson used to be wearing? Tell me you don't. No, I want to know. I got to say this. No, 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 wait, 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 wait. Let me say this, right? Why I'm hungry again? Why am I hungry again? I should have told this to bring me a steak, egg, and cheese. I think I need to go cook lunch. Akbar, maybe you need to slide in my DMs and tell me who the doctor is. Because at this point, at this point, Spice, I thought you was from the Caribbean. Yeah, because Ice Caribbean. Ice is the only one from the Caribbean. Well, apparently not, child. Spice says she's from Puerto Rico. Thank God I'm a loner and I stay in my room and I read my books. <laughs> What is Jessica even talking about? What is going on, y'all? It's Scott Santana, aka Cha 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 Chi Chi. And we are back for another daddies. Ice from the Caribbean. No, ice from the Caribbean. Because I'm here not to fight Gretchen, girl, because she don't fool everybody else except Gretchen. Child, because that's about to be her new name. Anyways, it's a lot going on with this reunion. <laughs> Y'all, listen, I'm not complaining. No content and coin, coin and content. And we got we got a lot to make up. We got a lot to make up. So we're going to be covering it all. We're going to be covering it all. Okay. And y'all know I'm going to be separate. Like I can't get into everything in one video. No, what I, okay. Coin and content, content and coin. So we're going to be separating it by, I guess, like the different topics and whatnot. So this video is going to be all about Santana. Okay. All about Santana, Mr. Saucy Santana as the, <laughs> as the host, as the host. Okay. Listen, because he is out here spilling tea. He's confirming things. He's throwing shade. He got shade thrown at him. And the girls are talking. The girls is talking. Look, he, he I guess we'll see when the reunion come here, whether or not he, he chewed a little bit. But we all know who would have been the better version. We all know who the better Santana is. Okay, don't, don't even play. All right. So, look. Before I make y'all go like this video, I do have an announcement, you all, okay? I do have an announcement. Hold on, let me get that banner out the way because you cut my sh off, okay? Um, I saw the suggestions. <laughs> no shade, I ain't like none of them. 
<laughs> and so the Scott Santana podcast just it just it just makes the most sense. Okay, it's a story time podcast, and this is a schedule. Okay. I am simultaneously as I'm doing this video, I am uploading um an old story time just so I can be able to push the podcast to these podcasting platforms so that I can start, you know, because just in case there's like a 72 hour delay or whatever, you know, I want to make sure like when I upload on on nine nine, it goes up that day and not a week later. So I'm gonna upload. You know something? Oh, just so y'all can be able to search up the podcast on Apple, Spotify, SoundCloud, wherever y'all want to listen to it and stream from. But this is the pod schedule, and it's just real straightforward and simple. Like nothing too crazy. Um, I do have some other things I want to do, but I want to start it off small, and we going to test this thing out and see how it go. But we going to be I'm going to be giving you classic story times as well as tea times. If you don't know what tea times is, basically, baby, that's when y'all write in y'all tea. Okay, I tell y'all stories. Okay. Or I go online and read Reddit stories, okay? And we react to them, okay? But it's going to be a key. Like, if y'all love my channel and you already love my videos, you're definitely going to love the Scott Santana podcast, okay? Haven't really decided yet if it's going to be fully audio or visual. Um, After I'm done with this video, I'm going to ask for some angel numbers and sleep on it. <laughs> but nonetheless, go ahead and like this video so that we can get into the tea, girl. Okay, from your favorite tea, girl. Don't call me that. <laughs> Do not call me that. Come and get your nuts. The different stuff is all right. I'm gonna do some kitchen day. So it's fine. I'm gonna do some kitchen day. It's so fine. I'm gonna do some kitchen day. Be outside. I'm gonna do some kitchen day. Cause I'm gonna do some kitchen day. I'm gonna do some kitchen day. Cause I'm gonna do some kitchen day. I'm gonna do some kitchen day. Cause I'm gonna do some kitchen day. I'm gonna do some kitchen day. Cause I'm gonna do some kitchen day. I'm gonna do some kitchen day. Okay, so, um, excuse me, can you get the, off the screen? Thank you. Okay, so we got to go ahead and get into the tea, girl. Um, I don't know where it all started. Like I said, I just been bookmarking posts, bookmarking posts, bookmarking posts. <clears throat> so I'm going to assume, let's see, right here. Um, <clears throat> Mariah Lynn calls Santana the worst host ever for the baddies reunion. Other cast members seemingly agree. Everyone has something to say about him being a host. So Mariah said the worst, the worst host ever. Santana replied the worst liar ever. Ooh. Santana then came out and said, can y'all tell who's a baddie, who's a maddie, and who's a saddie? Mm-mm-mm. Because -mm, apparently Anna Mac had some things to say about Saucy Santana. And I want to see if I can go to the original post so I can read the original comments. I don't know if that was the original post or if it goes back further. Okay, we're just going to see if it goes back further. Because y'all, it's so, it's so much. It's so much. It is so much going on Like when it comes to this reunion. But I mean, y'all know that's how it goes every time. Every time they film it, period, it's always just so much that ends up coming out, ends up being leaked. Um, then you have girls saying, I can't say, you know, because I don't want to get in trouble. And then you have people like DTB that tell it all. Like, girl, why do we know that you fought Tatiki? Okay. I mean, we knew that you was planning on fighting her, but not you coming out and confirming that you got effed up and then showing your fate. Girl, wouldn't it be me? Wouldn't it be me? I would have, I would have took a sabbatical or child, <laughs> a, a leave from work. I would have disappeared, child. Y'all would have been like, where she at? She must be in jail with Kashawn. Y'all know that whole free nut girl. Oh my god! At this point, because y'all saw the way that DTB look, child, they need to take her Sean and Tasiki to jail. Okay, throw her sister in there too, because them hands gotta be illegal. But anyways, <clears throat> this was the post that Anna did airing out Santana, and it said everyone didn't like him, not just Mariah. Y'all, I mean, everyone has something to say about him being a host. You know, it's weird when a gay man is hating on women, and whole time he wants to be one. It's just strange. He really strange. That's all I don't care about. That's all I don't care about. Messy and shady. That's your job. But he really was weird, y'all. A man who wears wigs, dresses like a girl, does everything like a woman. Most deaf wants to be a woman. It's okay though. I'm not gonna say what I really want to say because they're gonna say it's a hate crime. Can y'all just like <laughs> run me my flowers? Matter of fact, matter of fact, this is what y'all could do for me. <clears throat> this is what y'all could do for me. Mm -hmm. 
this is what y'all can do for me. Go right here. You scroll down. You put in your information. Go through the packages. I mean, there's also a page with the services and whatnot. And then you go ahead and click submit and have your money ready. That's what y'all could do for me because how many times do I have to tell y'all, host? I don't miss. <laughs> how many times do I have to tell? I knew. It was something about her that I did not like. And so I'm not even about to waste my breath on this because I'm not trying to get all riled up on this glorious what this child is today Saturday or Sunday. On this glorious weekend evening. I'm not, I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. I'm not. But what I will say is is that if you think like this, please unsubscribe. Just unsubscribe. You know, because there's a lot of people that will think like this, but then turn around and have gay hairstylists, gay makeup artists, wear gay luxury designers. You know what I'm saying? Like, chat, like, it, it's just like, how you homophobic and transphobic? But I'm not even going to go there. You know what? <clears throat> I don't have the energy. I don't have the energy. I don't have the energy. I, I don't have the energy. Let's focus on the story. But y'all already know I don't like Anna. Y'all already knew that. And now I see why I don't like her even more. But I'm going to just say, people that think like that, get away from me. Unsubscribe. You're not welcome here. Okay? Because it's very, it's a very idiotic way of, of thinking. Okay? And just because you have men out there who are, you know, dressing up and da da da, that don't mean that they want to be women necessarily. Not all of them. Not all of them. Oh my God, because I could really, I could really turn this. But I'm trying, I'm trying to keep this light hearted, so I'm not even going to go there <clears throat> and go on a tangent. But uh, okay, and then tomorrow we'll be complaining about these niggas that ain't shit in toxic masculinity when they going upside your head. But okay, 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 okay. Um, Mariah ain't lying. We had a terrible host, LMAO. Like who the f brought him in? And I don't give it who don't like it. Then Biggie says, definitely terrible. Mind you, just messy. Came to the reunion with a hidden agenda. Shout out to the blog. Okay, shout out to the Zeus C blog for getting featured. Anna Mac agrees with Mariah about her opinion on the host of Baddies Caribbean. Let's go over there and see. Well, now who was that? Zeus Hottesty? Girl, it's so much to keep up with. <clears throat> so much to keep up with. Okay, um, you got people in the comments saying they talk over the host and fight the whole time anyway. So it really, I know that in the two two two, and it is and it spirit. I already done told them. You heard me told them. Okay, you heard me told them. The Alana Souls dot com. Stop playing with me. Okay, everybody say hey spirit. <laughs> Not go book a reading. They said Santana was making them stand on business, so that explains why they mad. I'm sh I'm pretty sure that he did. I'm pretty sure that he did, and they probably, honestly and truly, I feel like Santana was probably clocking it. Like, uh-uh, girl, I saw the season. That's not what you said. Like, honestly and truly, I feel like Santana would probably give what I would give. Honestly, honestly, like if I had to imagine him as a host, I feel like he would give exactly what I give. And I feel like the Carisha Please interview was kind of like an insight, kind of like a look at what he's capable. What he's capable of doing. Um, oh, he must have read them for food. I like you. Hold on. I just hear like a lot of fucking banging or something. What is going on? Sitting here trying to work. Um, talking about who brought him in. Let me did boo. They don't like him because he clocks T. Santana mouth lethal for real. He gets into it with his own friends and don't care because they're gonna tell him he was right later. <clears throat> and that's all it is. That's all it is. It's like a lot of women don't have accountability. Like a lot of women have a problem with accountability and responsibility, like a huge problem with it. And it's like the second that you get told about yourself, like it even happens on my channel. Second that you get told about yourself, oh, you hate black women. Oh, da da da, -da. you want to. And it's like, it's, it's never all of that. You want to show about fighting. And if you talking mess in the confessionals or you on live talking mess and then that at the reunion, you want to act like you got a doctor's note or you sick or and you're not standing on business, we're going to call that out. That's what you want to show for. His sexuality ain't got nothing to do with that. But it's good to see the type of you are. It's good to see that. They can't stand the fact that somebody finally made them stand on business and called out their effery. I mean, I hope Santana did a good job, but not really because, girl, he not about to stay. 
he not about to say, okay, Zeus, stop playing with me. Stop playing with me. I hope that he did a good job so we can have a good reunion. But at the same time, girl, not too good. Not too good. <clears throat> okay, so that was that. And then Saucy Santana responded and said, Biggie, please, you ain't want to fight. You wanted to talk. And your friends was pissed about it. You not bigger than the program. Fight or hush. We laughed at Anna all night, cat fake passing out and walking off so she ain't have to fight. Clock it. Cl you know what, Spirit? Yeah, girl, I listen. Listen, I heard you. I I heard you, Spirit. I heard you. Okay. It's time for them to hear me. The Alanis, like, do I have to offer like a discount code or something? Okay. Like, like a like a first five people to go get a read and you get 50% off tight. Like, is that what I have to do? Because I could do it. Go book a read. Okay. Listen, stop playing with me. Okay, because I just said, I literally just said. But material girl, tease were clocked. You wasn't probably even being messy. You was just clocking a T, so that's why they mad. Oh well, he said tease was clocked. Finally, we got we don't got a yes man as a host. <clears throat> then being mad is a good sign. Every other host can barely get a word out. We've been begging for a host who can ask real questions. Right. Um, Anna says, I don't know what he's talking about. I was there. I just got hit by a bar stool chair. I'm so happy about that. And we're gonna talk about that in another video. And Anna might be a jokester, but Santana is a bigger one, so she might want to lay low. Exactly. Anna's a jokester, but she's not funny. That's the difference. <laughs> she she comes off annoying to me. Like I've never like I've never really saw it for Anna because she just everything about her just gives Aries, young spoiled baby sister, the one that gets babied and the one that can't grow up. You know everything that y'all look at Tamar and try to say. That's what Anna gives to me. Um, Biggie acts like y'all say Roly act. I'm glad Saucy clocked it. Y'all just choosy. Exactly. You can tell Santana actually watched baddies so he knows the tea and was clocking it. If you think about it, the last couple of baddies reunion hosts were Stevie J, Nene, and Trina. I doubt they watched baddies at all to keep up with all the drama. I'm pretty sure Santana was asking all the ish us viewers want to know. I mean, that's good for him. That's good for him, but not too much. Like, y'all loving him a little too much for me. <clears throat> Okay, um, did anything else? Because I feel like he was posting, he was most definitely posting on Twitter. So let's go back to his profile and see if, oh, <laughs> I said his. Oh, not she, me, hers. Okay, where we at? Let's go to the bookmarks. Because the girls started jumping in and confirming. Okay, so let's see. Um... Hmm. Okay. So they somebody said um they done beat the F out of DTB last night at the reunion, and Santana said, baby, child with saucy Janisha John as baddie's host. Let's go. Ready for it. Yo, I got a problem. He says, B, I had a ball. Fuji says, love how Santana keep a check. He says, keep. Then we have this post right here where Nunu says she be on up at the baddies reunion last night. And apparently Saucy Santana also said it as well. He was hosting a reunion. I'm not going to get into the clip because we're going to save that for honest portion. Because we're going to do a video on her and what happened with Nunu and da 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 da. We're just keeping this on Santana. But he says, LMAO, if we was going to be anything, we was going to be for real. So Siki gave DTB a root canal. I gagged. I remember the exact punch that I. Oh, because what's understood don't need to be said or repeated a third time. I'm just saying. Hey, spirit. Now, can you move? I'm trying to do a video. Okay. Um, and I'm glad I hosted the reunion because I saw exactly who won their fights. That ish was way better in person. Oh. Oh, I wonder how much he got paid. I wonder how much he got paid. So I don't know if y'all seen this video going around, but I'm gonna play it of Dame Dash. I want to know how real it is. I want to see your television network. I want to see you direct the movie. I want to see your clothing line. I want to see if you're the real deal. Test, see me, see if I'm the real deal. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Oh, 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 God. Here, talk to him for a second. 
I want to know how real it is. I want to see your television network. I want to see you direct the movie. I want to see your clothing line. I want to see if you're the real deal. Test, see me, see if I'm the real deal. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, hold on. Oh, God. Here, talk to him for a second. Okay. I want to know how real it is. Okay. So that was Dame Dash T falling out or Vanessa shot. I don't know. But Santana said that's how I was on the reunion last night. Teeth was everywhere, everywhere. Girl, the girls seem to be going up for him. Um, he says the lyr deliver baddies reunion insider that ish was too funny. So then, um, Kiva came out and gave Saucy Santana a shout out for making everybody stand on business. Shout out to. Saucy Santana, bitch. Make a bitch stand on business. Period. Bitch. Shout out to Saucy Santana. We love you, bitch. We love you. Now Period. We fucking love you. Very. You a real one. Regardless of what how the shit went, we fucks with you. I fuck with you. Yeah. 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 <clears throat> Big Queen Lakiba looks good. Oh my God. She looks she looks amazing. She looks amazing. Oh my, she looked like a star. She looked like a rapper. I love it. I love it. Now, who is that in the background? Cause don't it sound like wanna shout out to Saucy Santana, bitch. Make a bitch and stand on business. Period. <laughs> bitch. Shout out to Saucy Santana. We love you, bitch. We love you. Now you Period. Love. We fucking love you. Period. You a real one. Now you ever... like it, it got that same drag that Anna be having. Is that Tinka? Who is that in the background? Period, because these bees be playing, get in the field. Santana, how hard was you making them stand on business for that girl to get her tooth knocked out? Not how messy were you being? You got a girl's tooth punched out from the roof. Listen, is that what it took? Is that what it... Because at this point, at, the, at, at this point, at this point, and I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure this was 888. It's okay. The worst liar ever. Mm-mm-mm. Mm-mm-mm. <laughs> Let's take it on over to Baddie's T. What was they saying? Mm-mm-mm. We're going to get into all of this. Don't worry. Tommy and all. And her being back, child. We're going we to get into all of that. We're going to get into all of that. Okay. Got to separate it, though. Can't put it in one big video. Um. So let's see what it says on this Biggie post. You're not bigger than the program. Finally, somebody calls Biggie out for thinking she's above the program. Now, I'm even more seated. Mm-hmm. And then, you know, everybody's still saying the same thing. I mean, I don't know. Aren't reunions to talk about the show and recap what happened? Y'all making everything about fighting and losing the plot. Girl, shut the fuck up. This is motherfucking baddie. Shut up. Shut up. Exactly. Thank you, baby. Stand by baddie, not a maddie. Now, who is this? Who the hell is this? My page disabled, babe, so I couldn't give you your flowers online. However, I want to say you did an amazing job hosting, especially being your first time being a Zeus hosting a Zeus reunion. You brought the energy to tea, the drama, and fan-related questions. Congratulations, babe. You know I love you. Who the hell is this? Who the hell is that? Is that Bianca? That better not be Bianca. Now, what made that person think it was Bianca? Hold on, because if that was Bianca, we got to reread this. <laughs> hey, Santana. Hey, Saucy. My page disabled, babe, so I couldn't give you your flowers online. <laughs> I was too busy thinking about Mariah and Sapphire. But, however, I wanted to say you did an amazing job hosting, especially being your first time hosting a Zeus reunion. You brought the energy, the tea, the drama, and... <laughs> nah, nah, because this is Bianca Barney. This, this is Bianca Barney. She wouldn't have said it like that. She would have said, you brought the energy, the tea, and the chicken noodle soup with the soda on the side. <laughs> <laughs> the drama and fan related questions. Congratulations, babe. You know I loves you. Dead ass. New York Tim's big nigga cheese. <laughs> Please, that is not no Bianca. Okay, that is not no Bianca. Okay. 
thank you. Uh, it's baddies, not housewives. And he said, thank you. Somebody else said, why are you making me the topic? Of, oh, <laughs> somebody. Well, it is somebody else. Right. It's somebody else. So somebody else said, why are you making me the topic of your quick moment you had with Zeus? I, oh, I, girl. Girl, I'm, I'm trying to be cute and creative in the morning and professional. Okay. I got I, I to gotta switch back. Hello, well, why are you making me the topic of your quick moment you had with Zeus? I'm not giving no extras of a replacement's clout off my name. I'm sorry. So what you want? You big man. You big man. And I'm a big boss. I'm a big boss. A big boss that gets to the money. Okay? I employ. I employ. That's what I do. I'm a boss. Is you a boss? You might look like the biggest boss, but are you a boss? <laughs> I'm getting big money, honey. Okay, Biggie. Okay. Okay. Somebody said, Biggie, you please, you've been ducking fights ever since you became friends with Sasiki because you think she's supposed to fight your battles. Girl, at the uh, up and fight. Simple. You know what the, you fly up for? Miss, tell them don't touch. Oh, miss, tell them don't touch Biggie Tzatziki. What? Girl, shut up. Some of y'all be slow in these comments. So then uh, Santana says, quick moment with Zeus. I've had several. Right, because is she forgetting that he had his own show that didn't come out, but we still got a trailer for it, like it was going to come out, but it never came out? Because we could talk about it. We we actually could talk about it. Let's see if I can find it. All right. I mean, look, Zeus, if y'all wanted Saucy Santana that bad, if y'all wanted Saucy Santana that bad, y'all could have just revived his show. Y'all could have revived his show. Oh, yeah, a lot of y'all mentioned this in the comment section, but yes, yeah, Santana did have a show. Not me being messy in the comments. Not me. <laughs> Not me being messy in the comments of this random post. That's my Ratchet Recipes page. What is going on? I said, this is the problem with Zeus Trash ad. They be filming trailers for shows they ain't even filmed yet. They market and sucks. And I said that in 2022, apparently. Just messy. Oh my. What you over there being messy for? <laughs> what I'm over there being messy for? The show with Zeus Network. So the show was going to follow the format that Bobby's show was going by. And it was called Get Saucy with Santana. So Santana was looking for love and he was ready to date. And there's going to be all these men in the house fighting for Santana love. And there was a casting call and everything for the show. They was looking for men aged 21 to 45. But the show never came out. It was stuck in the coming soon phase. Now, a lot of Zeus shows is in the coming soon phase. Like, if you go on the Zeus app, you'll see a lot of shows that was supposed to come soon, but they didn't. This show in particular is nowhere on Zeus' channel. You can find a trailer on their YouTube page. But it's a couple theories as to why this never came out. Now, I did read somewhere that the network wanted Santana to be bisexual. And Santana wasn't feeling that because he wanted to be his authentic. Girl, what? <laughs> Girl, what? Girl, what? What? Bisexual. See, this is what I'm talking about, Zeus. Like, if y'all y'all out here getting carbon copies, when you could you could have just came to the original. See, I could have had my own show and did this. Okay, now we all know how much I love how I love eating hairy booty. Mm mm mm. Booty period, but hairy booty. Well, not booty period, because I mm, I would never eat a woman's booty, but ooh, I love men booty. We all know this. Okay. But if they wanted to do a bisexual dating show, baby. Okay, we could have called it the Sky Pantana show or something. Okay, for the pansexuals out there. Okay, we could have had a bit of everybody up there except trans women, because I don't do that. I don't do that. Okay. But they really could have just called me. And then I, we would have had enough rapport built up that then I could have came and hosted the show. See, Zeus, Bree at ZeusNetwork.com. So. However, I don't really think that's true because that kind of go against the flyer, which was looking for all types of single men. I do know that Santana did kind of get into it with Zeus Network like after this debacle. When Natalie was having her conversation with Red, she did name drop Santana a lot. Natalie was name dropping Santana and a lot of she's like, me and Santana was here and we saw Red. Santana wasn't feeling that. He was like, Zeus, stop name dropping my name. Y'all lying. Natalie, stop using me for cloud. And just alluding that Zeus and Santana would never be in the same sentence. So maybe it was just and look at us now. Look at us now. Why do y'all constantly reward bad behavior? But then I guess, I guess that's no different than me saying that Zeus is going to go down. And it's going to be a documentary and a Rico case someday. And then me still trying to host a reunion. I mean, I listen. It, mm, but this is a job. This is a job. I report on what I see. Okay. What I know and what I see. Okay. And if you don't want me to report on it, then how don't show it to me. Okay. Don't let me see it. Do it behind closed doors. 
the creator differences with the show or the money just wasn't right. Whatever the case may be, it's kind of unfortunate that we got this show because I do feel like Santana's show would have been more entertaining. Like, no offense to Bobby and his show, but his show just looked like a whole bunch of OnlyFans guys thrown in the house with him. They- and it was. It may make content. I don't know. But yeah, like I said, I'm making a whole documentary on the history of Zeus Network because I was just like, where did they come from? Like, how did I go from never hearing of Zeus to tuning in weekly and doing the research that y'all want? Now, that documentary probably won't go live until September because let me tell y'all something. I've done two of these documentaries. I did the Blue Faith and Christian Rock Relationship Timeline, which you can check that on my YouTube channel. Andy Rise of Follow Johnson's Cabaret on my YouTube channel, The Unpopular Party. Those documentary breakdowns take a good little minute to put together because you want to do the research, put the story together, you know, edit, all that good stuff, film. Like, baby, I'm adding producer to my resume because, huh. But I definitely plan on having that video to y'all like at the end of August, September, spring, summer. I don't know. Just subscribe to my channel, The Unpopular Party. Even after I got beat up, they were still screaming on names. Fussy was like, oh. And we're going, wait. Uh, we could get into it now, and then I'll come back to it. Like, why y'all saying on a name? Noodle just beat her up twice. <laughs> like, Boom. delusional. Delusional. Girl, that has makeup. It's makeup under my eyes. <sighs> it's makeup. Even after I beat her up, they were still screaming on a name. Saucy was like, why y'all saying on a name? Noodle just beat her up twice. <laughs> like, that sounds like a very thing that the Santanas would say. Delusional. Delusional. Girl, that is it's makeup. Uh, I keep saying I'm trying to wipe all this shit from under my eyes. It's makeup, baby. It's makeup. It's makeup. Why is she recorded on an Android? I'm gonna need a little bit more 4K, girl. I need to see them, 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 what you call it? I can't even think of the word. Pupils. Girl, the textures of her skin. Anywho. <clears throat> pores. I need to see them pores. Because, you know, when you don't record in 1080, when you record in, like, what? Shout 125? <laughs> 320 on an Android? Shout. You get this. Everything all blurred and softer out. No. Y- wait y'all know them um videos where they be like this is me before my shift this is me after my shift y'all remember that wait let me see if i can find it <clears throat> hi my name is kia this is me before my 12-hour shift this is me after my 12-hour shift Kiss the fuck off. Right the fuck off. Girl, they annoying me, but y'all remember that. And then they had the trend with the nerd right here. Hi, this is Brittany, 12 hours before my shift. <laughs> 12 hours after my shift. <laughs> <laughs> the way you feel. Zeus need to start making them do one of those. Okay, this is me before the reunion. This is me <laughs> after the reunion. Zeus need to start making them do that. Okay, because that that's what I want to see. Like, what happened? What happened? What truly happened? Okay, well, let's take it back to Twitter. Um, go ahead and like this video so we could get into these last bit of tweets. Go to the studio and mix some beat scandy. Y'all don't understand how much I love that song. I dropped that in what, 2016, 2017? And to this day, it's still my number one favorite song. 
Swing My Way would be like number two. Then Happy would be number three. Cheddar would probably be number four. Ignorant would probably be number five. But yeah, it's like, I just, oh my God, I love dinner. I love it. The the harmonies on that song, on that second verse. Baby, if you ain't never heard that song, please go rush and, and listen to it. <clears throat> never mind the album. But go listen to that song specifically. Oh, God, I love it so much. Well, let's get into these tweets. Um, and I don't have a personal vend- vendetta with any of the baddies because I don't know them personally. I came and I did my job. I watched the show and had the same feelings and opinions as the viewers. I actually kept going to the live audience to see if we had the same opinions on things, and we did. <clears throat> oh, okay. Well, now that you're up and clock and see, why'd you keep trying to get Joyce to repost a video with a lot, of- girl? Anyways. Mm. I'm glad they had you as a host. It's about time they got clocked for all the weird ish they do. They think they about a network and you wasn't, and they mad you was a kiss in the air. Mm-mm-mm. When I think about it, me and Janisha had our own insiders and we was key here all night. I live for her. Very demure, but with the ish. Mariah said it. She got, oh, Mariah said it because she got beat up. I know y'all ain't learned much in school, but have you learned about common denominators? Uh, uh, what? Okay. He said common denominators just gagged me. Um, okay. So, I mean, that's pretty much all we have for now, unless something, um, else has come out. So then Biggie said, let the reunion in, then you guys will see what's up. All this talking is for the birds. You mean you, Biggie? You are the bird. Girl, get this off my screen. Get this off my She is so skinny. She is so skinny, okay? <clears throat> oh, Tommy and her sister talk about the altercation. Let me say that. Let me go ahead and say that. Anything else? Scarface talks about how altercation revoked. Let me go ahead and say that. Who was this? Oh, Natalie. Oh, she looks good. Natalie looks so good. Oh, my God. Yes, best friend. Yes, best friend. <clears throat> uh-uh. She looks bad. Who told? She need to remove that BBL. She needs to remove that BBL. Huh? Like, uh, it just, it's, it don't look good. It don't look good. Okay, well, I guess that's about it, child. Let me know what y'all thought about all of this down in the comment box below, child. Is if I give up, okay? And definitely make sure that you go and you stream my music as if you give up, okay? Um, like I said, the podcast is dropping <clears throat> on September 9th for no reason other than the fact that it's Chi Chi's birthday, okay? Because come on, Chi the Love Fuera, Chi Chi, Nine Lives, you get it. Girl, you get it. September 9th, 9 9 is Chi Chi's birthday. Okay. So I said, why not? Let me just go ahead and rush this story time podcast that I decided to officially do like this morning. <laughs> Let me just go ahead and rush it and put it out. And that's what we're going to do, child. And we're going to stick to it. Okay. So I'm going to drop the first episode on 9 9, whenever the hell that is. I don't know when that is. I just know it's two days from now. And these will be the days that the episodes drop, okay? Like I said, there will be other goodies. Of course, Patreon is going to be receiving exclusive um, episodes, okay? And, um, yeah, I can't I can't wait for the tea times. Like, I know everybody loves story times, but I love tea times because I love reacting to other people's story times. Like, because it'd be wild. I mean, my story times be wild. And speaking of, <clears throat> I'm actually going to record... Um, my catfish horror story. I'm going to retell that story because I, I still have like a bunch of notes like filled with like, you know, a lot of my classic story times because, you know, for like the first maybe like at least 20 to 40 videos, um, I was writing down everything. So I still have like the exact scripts and all of that. And so I'm going to retell it. I'm going to retell it. And I might actually end up being the first episode, you know, just so I could get something out there. Um, Currently, I did just put up an old story time I told two years ago, just like I said, so I can be able to get the podcast on streaming. So that way, when I get time to, you know, when it's time for me to upload new episodes, it ain't no like, oh, we got to approve your podcast first before you get, you know, shout. That's how it be. 
if it's a brand new podcast, sometimes it takes a while for them to approve. And like I said, I just thought about all of it. I just realized today that nine nine is in two days. So I'm professional. But girl, where aren't we? Okay, when <laughs> when aren't we? Okay. So we just gonna make it do what it do. Look out for that. Um, I don't know if it's gonna be audio or visual, but I'm leaning more towards audio because I don't want to commit to visual. I don't, and I don't want people to focus on the visuals. I want you people to focus on the story. And if you know my story times, you know that I already give you an experience because of the way I speak and tell a story. Also, to the background music. And then now in 2024, memes and <laughs> put that where that that like so you know, but I do know that um having visuals it makes it easier to promote on TikTok and stuff like that, which is the only thing. Like I I really don't want to do visuals at all. I I don't, but it'll be so much easier to promote on TikTok. So I'm gonna figure that out. I'm gonna figure that out, but yeah, the podcast is coming. The podcast is coming. Like, I'm ready to start telling stories again. Um, Like, I'm ready. Like, I listen, I had a story time last night, okay? I had about, like, five story times in one night, okay? Between me falling out with a friend after I had saved their life. <laughs> after I had saved their life and after I helped them escape the cops and not go to jail. And after I helped them not get kidnapped, we ended up falling out because they, uh, it, it, it was just a mess. It was, it was a mess. And then it was a two man mission that went wrong. Um, <laughs> it went so wrong. And one of the guys was musty. Like <laughs> it looked like stay tuned for the pod, stay tuned for the pod. Okay. Because there's a new character. And if you remember the old story times, girl, if you remember the Heather stories, child, why we got a new Heather? Why we got a new Heather? And I think that's what I'm going to call her in the videos is new Heather. Because, girl, I love a girl that's DTF. I love a, a chick that is DTF. DTB? No, I say DTF. Girl, okay. And when I say DTF, I don't mean like necessarily down to fuck, even though it's helpful. I mean like a, a, a chick that's about anything, okay? Down to fuck shit up, Okay. So <laughs> please be looking forward to um, this guy's Santana podcast. Make sure that y'all have Apple podcasts downloaded or Spotify podcasts downloaded because yeah, every stream is going to count and I need y'all to actually go to the page once you see it up and subscribe to it. Okay. Every little bit is going like, <sighs> okay. You got to call her daddy out here getting 125 goddamn million. I'm hearing people get hit million dollar, six dollar, six million dollar deals and shit with the same analytics I had in 2017 telling stories. If you think I, what? Are you kidding me? Listen, I love each and every one of y'all. I'll see y'all in the next one. Risa Tisa, my aunt. Girl, girl. Universal bad bitch, everybody language, everybody know she the mud, mud, bad, bad. Universal bad bitch, everybody language, everybody know she the mud, mud, bad, bad. Universal bad bitch, everybody language, everybody know she the mud, mud, bad, bad. Universal bad bitch, everybody language, everybody know she the mud, mud, bad, bad. Fuck it up, love it how they cutting up. Now these niggas slowing up, but wasn't when I'm coming up. Fuck it up, love it how they cutting up. Now these niggas.